Okay, so we're given the equation 2x squared plus y equals c squared, where c squared is a constant, defines a family of ellipses whose major axis is the y-axis. Okay, so we want to find and describe graphically the family of orthogonal trajectories for the given family of curves. Okay, let's start off with 2x squared plus y equals c squared. So let's take the derivative now with respect to x. This is 4x plus dy over dx. Now the derivative of c squared is 0 because c is a constant. All right, now we're going to replace dy dx with negative dx over dy. Okay, so we're going to take, let's say, equation 1, take dy over dx, replace it with negative dx over dy. So we have 4x minus dx over dy equals 0. And here we're going to solve. So we're going to bring the dx over dy over. The 4x has to come down here. And dy has to go above to the other side. So what that looks like is dy equals dx over 4x. We're going to integrate both sides. So we have the integral of dy. So think of this as just 1 inside. This will just be y equals 1 fourth ln of absolute value of x plus c. Okay. So this is what we need. Now we're going to graph. So keep in mind, we have a family of ellipses. So depending on what c is, um, but basically what it looks like is the major axis is the longer side, and that's going to be along the y-axis. Okay, so the longer side is always on the y-axis. And now we have our 1 fourth ln of x plus c. So, you know, for each c, it's going to intersect. So the first one, the first ln of x plus c is going to intersect here. The second one, let's say, somewhere else. And every time, the intersection has to form a 90 degree angle. Obviously, this is not drawn to scale, but the idea is you have orthogonal trajectory, the orthogonal meaning right angle. Okay, so this is our ellipse. And these are our orthogonal trajectories. And this solves the problem.